guys, welcome back to a new video. I actually feel like I haven't done a video in so long and I actually don't think I have in like maybe almost a month, a few weeks, a month. There's no actual reason behind it, but I've just been doing other stuff instead. Yeah, I know I've been slacking with YouTube recently, but um, I will be back on it, don't worry guys. So in today's video, I'm gonna be doing a pretty little thing and boohoo haul. So I'm actually going to Ibiza tomorrow. So I've got a few little bits and bobs for my holiday. I've actually spent quite a bit this holiday and I shouldn't have. I would go for everything, but there's just so much bits I've got. But I, the main websites I have bought things off is Pretty Little Thing and Boohoo. So that's the reason I'm only doing those two. But yeah, I just thought I'd share it with you guys in case you'd like to see any of them actually on. So this isn't a first impressions video. Um, I have tried it all on and I shall go for it with you now. Everything I try on now, I will link in the description below and the sizes and everything along with the prices. So yeah. So I just wanted to quickly show you guys how funny this outfit is. I love this set, but there's a little bit of a problem with it, but you'll see why in a sec. So this is a size six, but it's part of the shape range. But yeah, look how baggy it is. Like, what is that even about? Do you know what I mean? As you can see, it's pretty big and it's only a size six, but I guess it is the shape range and I'm literally the most tiniest person ever. So I knew in a million years it wasn't gonna fit me, but it was worth a try. Yeah, I'll show you now what I've done to it. There is a bit of camel toe going on, but I plan on wearing a bum bag, so no one's gonna see that. Well, I'm hoping not so much anyway. But yeah, they come up a bit higher than cycling shorts because obviously I've literally had to roll them up about five, six times so they fit, and I need this belt to keep up. So yeah, I love the outfit so much, I just wanted to find a way to actually make it fit, and this is what I come up with. So yeah, thanks to this belt. So they're actually all right, they're not so bad once they're on. It's like super silky and stuff. And it's got these super cute, what do you call that? Like a ribbon down the side. And obviously you can tighten it if you want to. You can make the lace as long as you want as well. Um, but I've just kind of left it how it came. It's obviously a bright red with little white stripes going down. I think the outfit's actually super cute and I plan on keeping it. So I think it's perfect for like festivals and stuff. The, the top's like nice and fitted, which is good I didn't have to do anything to that so next up I've got this bikini from Pretty Little Thing I was really like unsure with it at first because like I'm not someone who really wears leopard print but I'll quickly show you now and it's actually quite flattering so I like normally I literally hate leopard print but like I find like these three colors literally go so well together like the white the like beigey color and the leopard print in the, and the nude in the leopard print. But yeah, I didn't think I'd like it, but I'm actually in love right now. Plus it's really flattering, like it really fits good around like the boob area, it's like nice and tight, so it doesn't like bag out, you're not gonna see any nipples, hopefully not. You do have adjustable straps too, so that's good. I know some bikinis don't always have that, and it's literally a pain in the ass. Um, oh my god, I'm out of breath. But yeah, I literally love this bikini. Like, I'm so happy with it. I think I got it in a size six. It's got this big band at the top. It's really nice and fitted, so it's not like baggy or anything. But yeah, I think it's really flattering. And it's more of like a thongy cut rather than like a brief, which is also nice. So that means no tan lights. I find with this bikini, I think it would only look very nice with a tan. I think if I was really pale, it just wouldn't work but yeah because I've got a tiny bit of a tan going on and um, hopefully more of a tan while I'm over there but yeah it's very nice I like it so next up I have this super cropped orange like neon almost orange top it's from boohoo I think it was only like four pounds but I was in need of more of these like more square neck little crop tops especially when it's so hot when you're out in Ibiza in the clubs and outside just in the day in general so I do like to be like really as minimum clothing as much as possible really because I literally hate being sweaty so I will literally just try get the least amount of clothing really. I was really unsure if I was actually going to be able to pull off orange but I think I've done okay. It's just like a really thin material, so you do have to be careful with it being see-through. Um, you can see my nipple covers a little bit, so just be careful if you're wearing like a bright, 
bra or something. Other than that, it's like really nice fitting, it's nice and tight. I think I got this in a size six and it's from Boohoo. But yeah, I love it. Next one is this super cropped, super v-neck um, crop top. I love this, but I feel like I would have suited like a white one better. But it was only really cheap anyway, I think it was like eight or six pounds, so I was like, there's no point in a return on it. So yeah, I just kept it. Ignore my bottoms, I just can't be bothered to chuck anything different on, so. So it does show a bit of underboob, so if you don't like having your end of you well, I wouldn't really recommend getting this. I've got it in a size six, because I thought a size four would be way too short, but I think I could have done with it being tighter around this area, so maybe I should have got a size four. This top is ribbed, as you can see. But yeah, I like it's really cute. I think I'd prefer this color and everything on someone else, not myself, but I love like the idea of the top. It's super cute, so I would recommend getting it. Okay, so next, these trousers that I have on, I feel like it was very hit or miss. It was very, it was a very risky game getting them. So yeah, they do have pockets. So as you can see, um, I've got the black stripe and it's like a maroon burgundy color. So they're a bit flarier at the bottom. They're not like tight or anything. The only thing I'd say about these is they're not like stretchy or anything. So if you're like kind of in between a size, I'd probably recommend sizing up in them. I'm also five foot tall and they were literally probably the right length for me. They didn't come too low, they probably sat around my ankle. Um, I don't know what any other sizes are gonna be like. I don't know if they lengthen much, but um, yeah, I'm five foot and I got a size four. So yeah, it's quite a rough material. Um, it's not as soft as you probably think it'd be. And you can tie it up with this here if you want to. They are really nice, but like, um, I don't know. I, I do like them, I'm just not sure when I'll wear them. I'll probably wear them in the evenings or like maybe they're suitable for like festivals and stuff. I just really wanted a pair because I saw everyone else wearing them and I just wanted to get on the hype. But I don't know if they suit me, but yeah, I think, I think, I think they're okay anyway. But um, yeah, I have decided to keep them and I may or may not wear them, but we'll see, but yeah. So next up I have this whole Jeanette skater dress on. With this dress, I probably won't take it to Ibiza only because it's not very Ibiza free. It's more of like a cute summer holiday dress. It's so flat and it's nice and tight at the top around my boobs. I think it is long enough as well. So like, if I was to stand up and the wind was to blow, it wouldn't really show my pants or anything. Yeah, I don't think you could really wear this with a bra. So I've got nipple covers on again. It's nice and tight and flattering. It's like a, I can't really explain the material, but it is comfortable. It's not like a gross one, so it's fine. But I got this in a size for as well and yeah I actually really like this I was really hesitant on this outfit as well only because I'm always wearing like tight clothing I know it's tight at the top but like even with my lower body I'm just used to having tight stuff so me in a flary dress was very adventurous for me so it is like a bright red I'm not sure if they had any more colors I want to say they had a white one but um it was I just went for the red one because red is like my favorite color. It's super cute, I like it. So those are the few bits of items I got of clothing. Um, I'm gonna quickly show you the last few things I've got that like accessories and shoes basically. So these shoes are from Boohoo and I absolutely love them. These are the shoes I got. And then they have a little lacy bit which you wrap around and tie up your leg. But yeah, I think they're super cute. They're like chunky heeled sandals basically. And I got a size three and the fit is literally fine. The only bit I would say is a bit baggy is like how flat my foot is or thin my foot is on this. But other than that, like they're absolutely fine to walk in and they're super comfy. So like the material is like a velvet material on here and then like a plasticky bottom. But yeah, absolutely love them and I can't wait to wear them. I'm probably gonna wear it with like a bikini or on my nights out. But yeah, they're great for like a little summer shoe really. Yeah, they literally go with everything because they're black, so can't go wrong. I think those were 28 pounds, but yeah, love. So last thing I got, <laughs> I've really tried it on like I said, it's this belt. So it was actually a bit too big for me. I'm a 24, five waist inch, whereas I'd probably say this would fit like, maybe like a 29 inch minimum. So what I've had to do, what I'm gonna do, but with black tape, 
I'm gonna tape it like this so it actually fits, but I loved it too much to send back and it goes with like the fringe skirt that I have, so like I can't send it back, I need it. So yeah, that's my only solution to literally tape it up and fold it over when I'm wearing it. Is that how it goes? Nope, just goes like that. So yeah, it's super cute. Those are all the little bits I got from Pretty Little Thing of Boohoo. Like I said, I just thought I'd film a few things that I got over the like the past couple of weeks to show you and share with you. I am sorry I've not had much content up on my channel at the moment but hopefully I'm getting back into it now and um, but yeah I just wanted to share this video with you guys just to show you what bits and bobs I got for holiday. I will put all the um, links to the outfits and bits and bobs below. I'm gonna finish this video with a gym workout. So this is a gym, this is a different gym I went to. It's called At The Gym in Nailsy and it's probably my favorite gym I've been to so far. It's just a shame of how far away I live from it, but it's absolutely amazing. But yeah, so this is the session with Amber. I'm gonna show you a glutes and hamstrings workout. I hope you enjoyed the video and I'll see you in the next one. And I'm making such a funny one hit cross. I'm here with my 15, how much is that? 50 kg. And what's on yours? And there's me, my little five and my ten. Ready, boo. Oh, it's filming. <laughs> you never used before. What's this one called? What? Is it like a hyperextension? Yeah, hyper anyway, hyperextension. Hyperextension? I don't know, we're gonna show you now anyway, so. But yeah, we've got a couple here to choose from. And the only problem I'd say about this gym is there's no water fountain. Why doesn't no a gym have, not have a water fountain? I don't understand. Um, I'm dying. <laughs> but I don't look hot, but I am really, really hot. You're getting high tissues, like. This is our outfit. Ombre matching. Right, ready? Stop, mate. Just gotta hook it onto your partner's leg. That's it.